Shane, you're coming into this prize fighter on the back of four losses. Would victory here be the ideal way to turn that around? Well, it would be the ideal way. You say the four losses have turned around in boxing now. I found a buzz back for it. So, and some of the losses really shouldn't have been losses. But, but now it's time to turn my life around and prove that I'm back in boxing now and I'm back here for God to do it proper. Where did you find that buzz from again? Well, uh, my ba- daughter was born six weeks ago, little Shana Lee. So as soon as she was born, I got back in the gym and everything just felt right. I've just had a bad year, I lost my trainer last year, missus was pregnant, everything just got on top of me. But now it just feels like something's hit me again. I feel like the old Shane again now, so it's time to prove that I had a bad year and it's time to prove that I'm back to my best. How's it been training for this prize fight with a newborn baby around? Oh, it's been brilliant. It's been good, to be fair. It's like we've been able to manage it. She wakes me up for my morning runs. So I go training and that, so it's been brilliant with her being around to play. It's like a different new life of being around, around it's brilliant. Just go to, back to something you said at the start, you've got six defeats on your record, do you feel that's an unfair reflection of your career so far? I do feel that is an unfair reflection. Uh, the first loss he had, in my opinion, I won the fight anyway and so did the other lad as well. My next loss was Michael Scott, after three fights I lose to Michael Scott and Potts. At this point, lost, but it wasn't a bad loss at that point in my career. Enzo Macarelli, everyone knows what happened there. And my last two, Dickinson, fair play to him, he won the fight, I just didn't turn up. And the last two fights, I really, well, especially the second last one, I shouldn't really have been in the ring to be fair in that one. I just wanted to, I was just out of it before I even got in the ring to be fair. The Enzo Macarelli fight, is that something that's behind you now? Oh, yeah, that's behind me now. It was, it had a big effect on why well, I lost a bit of buzz for boxing. and and that was around the time I lost my trainer and also everything put on top of each other it just it all got to me in the end but everything's that's all behind me now all the losses to me I've got no losses no wins I'm making a fresh start now zero fights zero wins and see how I go from there Is a rematch with Macronelli something you're still interested in or is that just gone now and in the past? It's somewhere I'd be in, obviously be interested in but I think that's gone now he didn't want the rematch we got the rematch he pulled out of the rematch gave up the belt then obviously failed the drug test to be honest, he didn't deserve to be the British champion after failing drug test, to be fair. I can end one like it. it. was my favourite boxer of all time, and to do something like that was a bit bad, to be fair. Obviously, you've got prize fighter experience. You got to the semi finals at the heavyweight prize fight. Will you be drawing on that experience in this prize fighter? Yeah, well, it's good to say that you've actually been in there, but I know for a fact there's some good lads in there, and especially some of them that you'll expect not to do good. I know that they're the ones to watch, including me. Everyone was writing me off. And there's another lad who's in this who do right off, but I know it, I think it could be me and him in the final. Who is that other lad? Uh, I can't really say because I've got a few mates in it, so it's not really fair to say. You won the British title from Leon Williams start of last year. Is that a belt you'd like to get back after Prize Fighter? Oh, that's definitely a belt I want to get back now. Uh, never thought I'd win it. I short notice for that, and after winning it. It's something I want to get back up to now and hopefully get the British and hopefully see if I can move on from there. But that is something hopefully I will be heading for again, the British title. Have you mapped your path back to that? Do you know how you'll go about getting back to British title level? To be honest, with everything that's gone off in the past year, I just want to get this out of the way first and see how we go from there. Take take one fight at a time. I'm not going to, I've never been one to look ahead of a fight, so I'm just going to get this out of the way and then we'll sit down and see how we go from there. It's the Betfair prize fighter. Why should the Betfair punters be backing you to win this prize fighter? Well, it's three three minute rounds. Everyone knows I'm more of a. I like my fights short and sweet. I'm better in three, four, five rounds. That's where I'm at my best. So three threes, that's where my strengths will be. And I can see it all going my way. Thank you very much, Shane. Thank you very much. Cheers,